at how we balance out time by ourselves, solo, time one-on-one -on -one with important people in our lives, and group time. Our reading comes, Sarah and I will read together from Walt Whitman, Song of the Open Road, and this, uh, Whitman is interesting, he was new to the Transcendentalist movement, he was a young guy in the group of older men and women who were talking about the connection humans have with all divine and all spirit and each other. But he was also in the beginning what's known as the realist movement. And they felt that the transcendentalists were a little bit too much poetry and wanted to break things down a little bit more into pragmatic living for people's lives. Afoot and lighthearted, I take to the open road. Healthy, free, the world before me. Henceforth, I ask not good fortune. I myself am good fortune. Strong and content, I travel the open road. I inhale great droughts of space. The east and the west are mine. The north and the south are mine. All seems beautiful to me. I can repeat over to men and women, you have done such good to me. I would do the same to you. Whoever you are, come, travel with me. However sweet these laid up stores, however convenient this dwelling, we cannot remain here. However sheltered this port, and however calm these waters, we must not anchor here. Together, the inducements shall be greater. We will sail pathless the wild seas. We will go where winds blow, waves dash, and the Yankee Clipper speeds by under full sail. Forward after the great companions and to belong to them. They too are on the road. Onward to that which is endless, as it was beginningless to undergo much, tramps of days, rests of nights. To see nothing anywhere but what you may reach it and pass it. To look up or down no road but it stretches and waits for you. To know the universe itself as a road, as many roads, as roads for traveling souls.